Hi guys, welcome back to the day 5 of Navrangi Navratri and the color for today is peach and green and we'll be doing a cut crease without concealer so let us begin. First I'll take this e.l.f. camo matte concealer and I will prep my eyelids so that the pigmentation is cancelled out and the eyeshadows pop better and I will blend it well with a concealer brush in small strokes dabbing motion and I'll do the same on the other eye as well. Now after that's done we'll begin with the eyeshadow. Firstly I'll pattern uh, off white shade on my eyelid just to set the concealer so that it does not crease and then I will go in with a very light orangish peach shade for my transition and I will blend it very very well in small circular motion so that it gives a beautiful transition and there is no harsh line whatsoever. After that I will take some light green shade on a flat blending brush and I will blend it only towards my outer corners and then I will again go back with the same uh, previous brush and I will blend the both the colors together so that there is no harsh line. I will apply a light shimmer shade from the same palette on the inner corner and now I'll go in with the liquid eyeshadows. So in the center I'm placing a darker coppery color and on my inner corners I am placing very light champagne gold color and I will blend both of them together using my finger so it gives a beautiful cut crease effect without using any concealer and it looks very very pretty for my eyelashes I am using the Kalilis magnetic lashes so I am applying the eyeliner that came along with it I have already mentioned this I absolutely love these lashes they are so 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 easy to apply and you get 10 different styles I have linked all the products in the description box below so make sure you check them out now before applying lashes I always apply mascara to my upper lashes it makes sticking the lashes well so now I'm sticking my magnetic lashes on top of that eyeliner and after I am uh, done setting the lashes in place I will pinch both my fake lash and my natural lash together uh, this uh, tends to uh, stick them together and it does not look uh, two different lashes now I will apply highlighter on my brow bone and my inner corner going with my eyebrow I forgot to do it earlier so I will brush my hair with the spoolie and with the pack cosmetics brow pomade I will fill in my eyebrows uh, with a angled brush now I'll follow all the same steps on my other eye as well beginning with my base makeup I am applying the Swiss Beauty highlighting primer on the top of my face the high points of my face sorry and I will blend it well using my fingers itself and you can see how beautiful shiny base it gives me it gives a dewy effect to the base and it looks very very pretty with foundation I'm using the Maybelline fit me foundation this is my absolute favorite and go-to foundation it has a decent coverage and uh, it is very very easily blendable and it gives a skin light finish and uh, also for summers it is perfect because it is matte foundation I really really like this so I've applied it all over my face evenly and now I'm blending it with the damn beauty blender like so in a little dabbing motions and while I will do that go down and press that red subscribe button and subscribe to my channel please and also let me know in the comment box below if you are enjoying this Navrangi Navratri series or not and which is your favorite look by far. I will be really really interested to know your views. Moving ahead with concealer, I am using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. Again, a very very affordable yet beautiful concealer. It gives again a medium coverage and it covers my little bit pigmentation that I have very very well and again it gives a very very skin like finish. I absolutely love this combo combination the Maybelline fit me uh, foundation and concealer together I really really like it so I have applied it under my eyes and on the areas that I have acne scars on and again I'm blending it all together using a concealer brush from the wet and wild contour palette I will take the banana powder and I will dab it lightly under my eyes to set the concealer in place and I will set my entire face using the same banana powder uh, especially on the areas that I had applied concealer on so that it does not crease it is a very very beautiful powder it gives that highlighting effect it brightens up your face and it looks very very nice 
now from the same palette i'm taking the contouring shade again my favorite contour and i will just lightly bronze up the cheekbones and my nose that's it i'm not gonna go very heavy with contour and now working on my lower lash line i will apply that lighter green color that i had used on my outer corners and uh, i will blend it well on both my eyes and now i'll apply mascara to my lower lashes uh, and it looks very very pretty this wand is perfect to work under the eyes now i'm taking a nude cold pencil and i'm applying it on my waterline it just opens up the eye and looks beautiful now i'm taking this touch blush palette i'm taking the peach blush shade and i will dab it slightly upwards so that it gives me a lifted look and i'll do it on both the sides this blush palette is really pigmented going in with maybelline master chrome highlighter in the gold shade i am applying it to the high points of my face uh, this golden highlighter goes perfectly well with my entire makeup today and i'm already liking how the makeup looks and i'm applying this lipstick chillin air from maybelline creamy matte range the perfect lipstick to go with this shade i am absolutely in love and i'm topping it up with the sugar lip zip matte topper just to mattify the lipstick so that because i just don't like a uh, shiny lipsticks um, very much i prefer my lips matte and with that this look is very very complete let me add some accessories and voila i look beautiful ain't i comment down below how you like this look and also guess the color for day 6 and if you have not subscribed to my channel yet please do so now i'll see you super super soon tomorrow in my next video bye